Hi guys, I'm coming on to you today because it's Monday and I've been uh, wanting to participate in this open collab that Tree from Tree Craft On and Kathy from Kathy's Creative Crafts um, has been doing for quite a number of weeks and it's called hashtag let's die cut Mondays. And I thought that this was a great way um, for me to dedicate one day out of the week where I'll just do some die cuts and it could be die cuts that I want to use on future projects, um, maybe something that um, that is common for me like banners and sentiment strips and you know anything. But I know the program was intended for us to be able to pull out some of those favorite dyes that we love using or even the ones that we've never used that we kind of just bought because we loved it and we had to have it and it would have been a great addition to our staff stash but we have yet to pull it out and play with it so this particular die i got from aliexpress and i'm actually uh, working on a c theme project so i thought this would be a great opportunity to pull it out um, get my scraps out and die cut some um, of these cute little sea creatures uh, in all colors and as I'm working on my project I could just nitpick which ones I need or which ones coordinate the best. So this is a little squid and this is supposed to be like the ink blotches and the bubbles and it does emboss here but on the paper that I chose you just don't see it. This is the jellyfish sorry about my nails guys i haven't had time uh, hopefully sometime this week i can get to go and um, cut these out but i'm not going to use them all in jellyfishes and i'll explain once i show you the dye the colors that i chose and then you got this cute little crab i think he's super adorable with his big eyes and then of course you gotta have the fish So that's the die set that I pulled out for this week. And I only cut out three crabs because I know I have more of this um, glitter paper in scraps. I just got to find them. That's how they cut out. And I think they're super cute. I just got to poke out his eyes. Oh, that sound is so bad. <laughs> that sound is so bad. Not intentional, guys. Not intentional, but... It does look like his eyes do um, cut out, but they're so little, so I just kind of left them. As long as I get the impression, I'm fine. And then I cut out the fish in uh, different colors because they are beautiful and they come in different colors. I think I got all the colors here. So I cut out a few in green, and this is like a shiny um, paper green. I cut it out in blue. And you can see the shine in purple. This is glitter. This is that same paper as that one, shiny. A light pink and a glitter gold for my little goldfishes. So I cut out a bunch of those. And then my squids, I cut out in this ombre paper that I got for one of my discount stores. So it starts really light and it gets really dark. So I cut a few of those out. I cut them out in pink just because, and you can see how the eyes come out. So I just gotta finish popping those out. And these are really intricate. I cut out a few in gold just because, and this is a lighter gold and this is a darker gold. I just pulled out scraps and just started just cutting away. I was sitting in front of my TV and I was watching um, what was I watching? I'm on a binge watch with Monk now. Monk has been out for decades. And now, I don't know. It's just really cute to listen to in the background. And then these are the jellyfish. So I cut them out in silver. And you can see the tentacles are very intricate. I also cut it out in purple. I did cut it out in blue. And then this particular glitter paper, this is the one from the Dollar Tree. So this one cut out fine, but then these 
started snagging and this was like really the worst one but i'm not worried too much with these because i only cut these out in this color because i wanted to use the tentacles as um Sea floor foliage. I don't know if that's what you call it. So if you close that off and then cluster them all together, you can kind of use them as you know the the seaweeds and the on the bed floor. So these are gonna be cut apart anyway, and then I can just salvage. And this comes out. You can I can just salvage the pieces that I need. But um, yeah, this was not the best. Paper, and probably because it's sticker paper. So, got to find another green, but I'm not going to let these go to waste. So, there you have it. This is my share for this week's open collab with Tree from Tree Craft Dawn and Kathy from Kathy's, Kathy's Creative Crafts. Uh, let's do die cut Mondays. Um, they're doing weekly giveaways. You could do a giveaway. You can pull them out just to build up your stash. You can... Um, cut them on Monday and use them on a future project later on in the week. Whatever you decide, guys. But of course, the two hosts, uh, the two hostesses, links will be in my description box below. As always, have a great week. Stay crafty. Stay blessed. Stay healthy. Stay safe. And I'll see you at the next one. Bye now.